Hey guys, it's me, Loka. But, but you, you already knew that, right guys? Yeah. And this is, this is La La Land. So, let's get started this week. I'm going to tell you the tale of a scary, spooky demon. I just learned about this, guys, and it really is legit scary, guys. There's a spirit like no other, known as the demon Skolomox. It's a flying devil, horned skeletal demon, guys, from the underworld. The Skolomox will take many forms, but most common is that of an evil jester known as Schizoid, guys. But, but join me by the campfire, and I'll, I'll tell you the rest. Okay. Okay, you'll like this one. Okay, bye. See you there. See you over there. Hey, guys. Before I get started with my next video, I want you to go to Etsy.com backslash DreamState83 so you can pick up your Bomber Clown t-shirt, guys, and other cool designs. Links in the description and below. Okay, enjoy the video. Bye! Alright, guys, like I was saying, this demon is named Schizoid. And when it's in Earth form. Alright guys, it's like the scariest thing ever. I, I, I can't stress that enough, guys. This demon kills its victims and collects their souls. Its victims then become part of the demon. Yeah. <laughs> That's a scary thought, guys. They ultimately share the Skull of Monks' life force like a collective, guys. This is similar to the Borg. Only it's zombies. If you know anything about the Borg. And not cyborgs. Zombies, not cyborgs. Remember that, guys. However, there is no chance of survival once the Skull Monks gets a hold of you. But don't worry. Okay, guys? It's not like you're gonna encounter the Skull Monks. It changes to the Schizoid Clown at night or another member of the Collective during the day, guys. Okay? I, I have faith. You're, we're not gonna we're not gonna get captured. The demon resides in hell until it feeds. Or it will hide out in the shadows, guys, searching for its prey generally targeting the ill-natured or the weak. So I think we're good guys. Because I'm... I'm pretty strong. See guys, working out, strong-minded, prepared for anything guys. If you happen to cross paths with the demon, you should let it be. Don't acknowledge it no matter what it is doing, or it will unleash its will on you and you will become its next victim. So don't do that guys. Don't be a victim. Run like hell the other direction. Don't look back or it will give chase. Sorry guys. I just realized I didn't put my boobies in. Now I'm loca. 100%. I need something to film in front of you guys. Okay, anyways. I'm back. We're going to finish this, finish this tale. So, watch out. Just remember... Always keep in mind, watch out for this thing. It's unknown what can defeat the schizoid. Okay? I understand that possibly binding the demon to an item that's that's to be blessed by a holy man or trapping it in some kind of like divic box and in turn burying it in a holy place. These are the only way of disposing of the demon. But how to trap the beast, that remains a mystery. Since no one's supposed to look at it or even acknowledge it. Your chances of survival, guys, could increase if you encounter a member of the Collective, you need to remember this. Remember, you need to decapitate the head, burn it, and bury the body. That's the only way, obviously, weakening the demon. That's the only chance, guys. This ensures you can't be tracked and will be safe for the remainder of the feeding period. Unless you get, unless you get targeted dur during the next Friday the 13th or Halloween. Oh yeah, Friday the 13th and Halloween are the two was the two danger days. I know there's several throughout the year, but Halloween, I hear, is like the biggest threat. Even though, like I said, there's, hell, there's 13th, Friday the 13th, all year round. I'm just trying to help you guys. Which leads me, like I said, to its feeding schedule. Legend says the Skolomox feeds every Friday the 13th and Halloween. The Skolomox must feed for a 24 hour period, guys, to ensure its survival until the next feed period. Which reminds me, are you ready for Halloween? I am. <laughs> Don't worry guys. I made this up. I made this whole story up. Trick or treat. <laughs> or did I? Ooh, I'll never tell. Well hey, I'll see you next time. I gotta go now. I know in a couple weeks, 
It's happy Halloween, eat lots of candy, and don't become a victim of the Scullamucks. Okay, bye! Bye! <laughs> bye! Look, I love you! Happy Halloween! <laughs>